Uh, from there, uh, we got the very first... No, no, no. The, well, the very first AWS World Championship match for this year on AWS Intensity. This one I really liked, all right? It was a six-pack match. Um, channel, California Kid 1. California Kid 1. Like I said, great stuff. GWC, great stuff. Uh, six-pack match for the vacant AWS World title. The title was vacated, which is really sad how the GWC is having all these titles being vacated on them. Uh, it's a real shame. Um, I just, I don't, I hate that, man. You know, if you got to vacate because of injury or such, I mean, you do what you got to do, but I think Becky Wrestling needs to start working on keeping the lineage going. There are organizations out there where they almost never have title changes because everyone just wins a title and then leaves, or they don't want to lose a title, so they leave, or whatnot, you know, and it just really dumbs it down. Uh, so, I hope, I, I personally hope that it's not going to be Battleborn Wrestling. I'm trying to keep a lineage going, I'm trying to uh, make sure all the champions have their defenses and will inevitably lose the title rather than just leave or whatnot. And, yeah, so, it's, it's really a bummer that that happened to AWS. Um, but they had this, hey, we got a reward out of it. The fans got a reward because great, great six pack match. And I'm going to take a drink and I'm going to tell you about it. Because first we had Lycan come out. You know Lycan, right? He was a mm, phenomenal wrestler. From there we have Fury. Looking familiar? Wasn't Lycan and Fury in... Yeah, hold on. I'm pretty sure. I want to make sure, though. Yeah, I'm right. Lycan and Fury. The men who were in the Intercontinental title match. Also in the AWS world title match. I feel that's good. I like seeing the Intercontinental Champion in the world title match. Essentially a mid-card title um, is supposed to be like the next big thing. So to see him in these giant matches like this six-pack match is a good thing to me. I always go by what the NWA used to do. Uh, the second tire belt meant you were the number one contender. That's how I feel about it. Uh, if you're the United States Champion or Intercontinental Champion, that means you're the number one contender. Uh, it doesn't mean you're going to fight for the title. It just means you're like the number two guy in the organization. And so to see him here, uh, you know, as a 3W champion and the BW Intercontinental champion, I think that's a great move. Uh, we also have Dead Dude. Um, from there, we also have Camo Kid and, of course, Damien, uh, Damien Zadok. Damien Zadok who once held the AWS world title, a fantastic champion, fantastic. Check out some old Damian Zadok title defenses, those are some good ones for you. But uh, Damian Zadok winning this match, it was a huge match. This went on for a long time. Um, it was completely and thoroughly entertaining, six pack match, elimination style, Damian Zadok is the new AWS World Heavyweight Champion. Fantastic! I just wish they could have done it with the Intercontinental title too, but it, I'm not even going to complain. This match just made up for everything. Great, great match, alright? AWS really showcased, they showcased who the top guys are. Even if they didn't get to the mid card lower guys, they showcased, they said, these are our six top guys this year. Watch them, get ready for some great stuff, get ready for some great feuds, and here's a little hint of it, you know? So I really enjoyed this AWS Intensity. Kudos to you. Uh, after that, we have EWA. They had their uh, February 27th show. Uh, I'm just going to review that really quick. It's from Middlese Middlesex County. How would you like to be from there? Middlesex County, New Jersey. Uh, EWA Vids is the channel. And in their main event, they had the EWA Heavyweight Championship match between TJ Blade and Joe Hall. And I want to point out something. The after show they showed, it, the editing was so superb. Whoever does the editing for EWA, you are awesome. All right, I'm just going to say that right now. Awesome is you because that editing, freaking fantastic. Loved it. Being a guy who edits all his own videos and stuff. Oh, well, hold on. I bow to you. Fantastic. Get out of my face, paper. All right. From there, we have... ETTW, Extreme Technical Trampoline Wrestling, had their Kicking It Old School event. Really like that name, Kicking It Old School. It was in Border Bordentown, the channel, other 
ETTW. They're starting to use this channel, other ETTW, for their ETTW shows. So just to, just so you know, they're, they're kind of going back and forth. They're switching. Uh, other ETTW. Check out some great trampoline wrestling. I say, and I think I've said this before, personally I feel that ETTW does the best trampoline wrestling in the world today. Wow! Damn, do they have some great backyard wrestling on that tramp. Aline. But anyway, after that we have BWE Adrenaline, the very first edition of BWE Adrenaline for 2009 in Georgia. California Kid One once again hosts this on his channel. The match. C.J. Lennon wrestling the BWE World Heavyweight Champion, Sean Owens. These two are no stranger to each other. Great, great stuff. When That's these two guys meet, woo, doggy, you're going to have some imagine. good times. C.J. Lennon, Sean o. Evans, uh, BWE Adrenaline. Check it out. All right. After that, we have uh, the Balborn Wrestling Approved ATW Showdown uh, uh, from February 27th. In Queensland, ATW Media is the channel. Here's the thing we have. We had a battle royal this time num for the number one contendership of the ATW Queensland Championship. Pretty, pretty good. Um, the winner of that match was the Donald. So there you go, ATW Media. Uh, you'll be seeing it on Visual Devastation as part of Valborn Wrestling's territories as I will be uploading it there. Uh, from there we have CCW Forsaken, which happened on March 1st in the United States. The channel CC West. Uh, just one W, CC West, CCW Est, alright? Uh, in entertaining matches, Shannon Sharp wrestled uh, the CCW Champion, the finale, and the CCW Championship match. Um, Matt, uh, that was for the CCW Championship, and it's, I'm trying to read my own words because it's all wacky. Uh, oh man, I don't even want to say this. Matt Custos. 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 I have no idea. Matt Custos wrestled the CCW YouTube champion, the tragedy. The tragedy. Anthony Lee. That's another one. Check out CCW Forsaken.